check this video and get familiar. What's cracking? We're gonna be rocking with Remix Report all day. It's freaking cold out. God, wow. <laughs> Let's crack. We are here. <laughs> we got one scene almost done. And uh, we're going to be moving to the next part. We got a steady cam shot. It's going to come in. You can show them the turntables. It's going to come right in on the turntables. It's going to look crazy. We're crazy. And he's dangerous. Danny Danger. There's many meanings for the title killer. One is uh, if you're a DJ and you come in the club, you come to kill that club, so you're a killer. As a DJ, it is your job to help people get rid of worries and stuff that's on their mind and stress because they come to the club to let loose and relax, so you're killing bad vibes, you're killing you know, people's stress and providing a good time. In the video, you'll see the moral of the story in the video. Many layers. I like to write with many layers. Get from there. Fortunately, I don't have to splash blood on myself. So we, Clinton pulled us in on the ambiguous remix, as you hopefully heard. If not, you should uh, get familiar and go to soundcloud.com backslash the disco prize or backslash Clinton Sparks and get the record. Um, and then after that record did well online, we, uh, we put this thing together and uh, from there it's just been like the craziest day ever. Yeah, it's, it's something that Nick and I kind of worked together like on the instrumental or whatever and we, we knew we needed to get it, you know, in the right hands with someone that was going to add some to the song and once we hand it off to Clinton, it's really crazy with this. Well, these Eli guys actually sent me like 20 beats and uh, yeah, that's, true. that's the beat that jumped out at me the most. Gonna die tonight, tonight, tonight. Well, being a producer, I've been on the set for a lot of videos that I produced from Pitbulls, Shut It Down, to Akon, Sorry Believe It On Me, um, Ludacris, Down in the Dirty. It's been a bunch of videos and uh, I always have visuals like, I, I hear sounds, and I see sounds, and when I write songs, I have to already have the story in my head before I can write to it. So it's like I create a movie, and then I write to the movie that I'm watching, as opposed to just writing. So I pretty much have the video done in my head before I even write the song. So um, this is technically my directorial debut, and I'm excited because I have a lot of um, ideas and visuals in my head that I want to share with the rest of the world and since I've been fortunate enough so far at the beginning of my stage of becoming an artist of people accepting the music that I'm putting out hopefully um, the uh, creative visual side of me is accepted as well although this video is a little creepy uh, 
yeah, well, the concept is basically just, um, you know, myself, I represent me and my gang of hooligans that you see running through this mill. We represent, as well as the Disco Fries, we represent um, the outcast, the uncool deemed by society in this video. And uh, we're characters that have basically been kind of told like we're losers, we're creeps, we're, we're weirdos. And uh, that's the reason we look weird. It's not necessarily how we really look, but it's how we feel and how we look is a reflection of how we feel by being an outcast. So that's what this video represents. And then, um, you know, there's a moral of the story to the video. If you watch the whole video, you'll see that it's not just a bunch of creepy looking people running around breaking things and having a zombie party. There's actually a moral point to the video. So uh, get familiar when you watch the video. They're cool guys, man. I mean, they, they send me the music. Uh, we correspond on email and then we'll call each other and I'll say, hey, let's try changing this. And he'll say, what do you think about this? And, and I'm like, cool. And then, uh, you know, that's, that, you know, this is not the last thing we're going to do together. Ambiguous and Killer is just the beginning of Clint Sparks and Disco Fries collaborations. We already have other music in the making. And uh, matter of fact, DJ Snake, my partner, is working on a remix to kill it. Oh, and here comes our man, Seb One. Oh, what's up? And it's wonderful that you guys are all conversating about this, but we have work to do. So <laughs> we'll be right back. Let's go. See you guys later. Kill it. Now watch me. Music.com, RemixReport.com, get familiar. Remix Report, bitches, get familiar. Disco Prize in the house, what do you think about that? TheRemixReport.com. In the house. In the house.